which is also not that good. So, right beside that, most of you or some of you are gonna have the opportunity now to play on ultra frame rates. That means uh, 120 uh, FPS. That's that's really nice. That's that's the only thing I like about this update. Okay. Once you do that, also you can, I can play now on very high graphics, but it lags. This is one, this iPad is, is um, iPad Pro 2021 with M1 chip, one of the top devices. And if it lags on this one, then I don't even know why they put those, those options available on my device. It was lagging. The whole day I've tried different things, different everything. I even took my iPad off the case because I thought maybe because it's heating, it's too hot or whatever. It didn't work. But the last game I played, I put it on high. I changed the, the graphics from very high to high, put the ultra FPS. Then if you scroll down, you have super resolution and you have a uh, variable rate shading. This one basically reduces the graphics if there are too many things happening around so you can run smoothly. But before doing that, you have to do also start shader preload. So if you if you if you read what's written in here, it takes a bit of time, but it's drastically improve your frame drops, okay? If you're lagging or all that stuff, it reduces the lag. And on top of this, I downloaded a game game booster. I had it. It's Gear Up Booster called. If you search it up, you you'll see. It's also a VPN. I cannot turn the VPN off. It's but you can choose the server European, Asian, whatever. So I choose European. And uh, 